While she's certainly not one to skirt the spotlight, Ivanka Trump hasn't posted on Instagram or Twitter since January 19, 2021. And while her dad has moved out of the White House and into Mar-a-Lago, Ivanka's social media accounts still claim she's a, quote, advisor to POTUS. Oversight, burnout, or a secret desire to make a political comeback? You decide. Still, the New York Times reported that Ivanka promised Marco Rubio that she wouldn't challenge his U.S. Senate seat. As her former best friend wrote in Vanity Fair, Ivanka might be both ambitious and, quote, shamelessly vain, but the Times source told the outlet that the Senate wasn't something she's ever really been serious about. Does it make you want to run for office yourself? Oh, gosh. I, I, you know, for me, it's, it's um, the politics is truthfully less interesting. So what is Ivanka really up to these days? Hard to tell, but we at least know where she might be. She and her husband, Jared Kushner, reportedly shelled out $30 million for a plot of land on Miami's Indian Creek Island, aka Billionaire's Bunker, from legendary singer Julio Iglesias. There, they may one day live next to Tom Brady, the man Donald Trump famously once wanted Ivanka to marry. While they go about building their dream house on the island, Ivanka and Jared are living in the oceanfront Arte surfside complex in Miami, Florida. The Daily Mail describes the building's 16 exclusive residences as some of Miami's most sought-after real estate. And according to Architectural Digest, Ivanka and company have signed a one-year lease on their Arte Surfside home, most likely for tens of thousands of dollars a month. Price, of course, isn't likely to be an issue for Ivanka and Jared. If Vanity Fair's report is correct, the two made up to $640 million during their time with the Trump administration you're setting the tone that it is just about money. As for the rest of the family, Ivanka's three kids, Arabella, Joseph, and Theodore, are already attending school, which, per the Daily Mail, is a 15-minute drive away. It might be worth noting that, according to snaps from the outlet, the kids' uniforms look a lot like those of Miami's Hebrew Academy. But in any case, being kid-free during weekdays means that Ivanka has time on her hands. While her former best friends are busy writing Vanity Fair exposés condemning her character, Ivanka may have found a bestie replacement, one who shares her New York roots. If you believe the buzz from journalist Sophie Ross, Ivanka is spending at least part of her free time in Miami with Ariel Charnas, who happens to live in the same building. Charnas, an Instagram influencer and the creative director at the fashion brand Something Navy, garnered scrutiny from BuzzFeed in April 2020 for being the epitome of, quote, privilege during the pandemic. Maybe these ladies are two peas in a pod when it comes to the glare of the media. Still, even if it is the beginning of a very elite friendship, when the Daily Beast reached out to Something Navy, the company wrote in reply, they have absolutely never met. Um, maybe in the elevator? Anyway, the Daily Mail certainly seems to have set up camp outside Ivanka and Jared's new apartment. And other than possibly chilling with other wealthy residents, Ivanka seems to be doing a lot of nothing, really. We're guessing she might be enjoying a few sets on the tennis court at Mar-a-Lago with her dad, who she is still advising, according to Politico. She's also also likely enjoying her private terrace, and access to a lap pool, sauna, yoga studio, steam room, and meditation pond at her own residence. According to the outlet, when Ivanka is at home, she enjoys cuddling with her dog and writing. When she leaves the house, it's usually to go for runs with her children in tow, grabbing ice cream, and visiting alligator parks. On the beach, she's been spotted nose deep in books like The Five People You Meet in Heaven. She's also been seen with her family in on-brand, immaculately matching outfits on a tour of the Everglades. But maybe Ivanka is just waiting to start her new political life. Because if what author and journalist Michael Wolf says is true, Jared and Ivanka made a pact long ago that Ivanka would one day run for president. Her mom, at least, sure seems to agree with the idea. I think she could be one day the first girl of woman president. Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more list videos about your favorite celebs are coming soon! Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one!